with everyone today. Welcome to the Dirt Road Farmer. Well, uh, today we're going to finish up our mustard. Uh, we've got just a little over 900 acres to do. And uh, oh, we're going to finish it up today. And that'll be a, a total of 2,800 acres or a little over 2,800 acres of mustard that we have harvested. Uh, today, uh, we're going to be using uh, five harvesters. And uh, just one truck because with mustard, uh, you don't get a lot of grain. Mustard seeds are really small so you don't really get a lot of grain uh, but it pays very well so uh, and this will wrap up our harvest season once we get this 900 acres done uh, it'll wrap up our complete harvest system or uh, season so anyway uh, we're off to a good start, and uh, yeah, we're going to carry on. Well, we are just about to get this field finished up, uh, and then we'll move into the field next to us over there. We'll have two more fields to do, and both of them are a little over 300 acres apiece. So, yes, we are coming right along. Everything has really been going good. Uh, good. And uh, right now, the mustard prices are down. Uh, we can pull our HUD up. And, of course, we got to wait for it to save. All right, let's go down here to mustard. Uh, one place is six, Patterson's is 6,822. Cargill is 6,359. Uh, that price is down a little bit right now, but Cargill is on its way up. So it, it will get uh, over seven, 7,000. So, oh yeah, <laughs> but uh, we're going to finish this field up and we'll get right into the other field and get started on it. Well, we have started on the second field and uh, <laughs> we've got a great start we've got one more field to go and that's the field we're looking at uh, next to this one there and harvest season of 2023 I guess or 2022 <laughs> will be done <laughs> uh, it uh, these harvesters each one of them, there's five of them, and we have got approximately 50 hours on each one of them. Uh, not just from mustard, but from the rest of the farm. You see, we are farming, uh, let me see if I can get the right number. We are farming 7,322.61 acres. That's how much we're farming. So, yes, uh, like I said, there are several hours on each harvester. Uh, and probably every other year, we will probably have to trade harvesters. So, whenever you see us where it looks like the money is really going up 
and yeah, it is going up, but it'll come down equally as fast. Uh, like I said, every other year we're looking at probably replacing harvesters, so <laughs> uh, harvesters, headers, you know, uh, could be uh, we're replacing planting equipment, toolbars, air carts, so uh, anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to work on this field. We're going to try to get it done. We can get in the next field and get it done. All right. Well, we are just about to get this field done. We have one more field to do. Now, this field is, <laughs> for lack of a better term, it's cattywampus. <laughs> That's a good word, ain't it? Cattywampus. Uh, yes. Uh, it's kind of at an angle. And, I mean, it's okay. Uh, of course, play handles it. But it kind of makes you wonder, you know, Whenever you start harvesting and you see jagged edges like this, uh, that's because the harvester is following its uh, its road. And what's going to happen is we will, as you can see, those harvesters back there, they're not harvesting anything because it's at an angle. Now, as the farther up this field they go, they'll start harvesting. You know, they will get into the crop, but that's because everything is shifted over to the left side. Uh, hard to explain, but I know some of you have experienced that. So as you can see, this harvester here is starting to leave some for the next harvester. So, <laughs> oh yeah. So, where he wasn't harvesting anything, uh, he's going to start harvesting right there. So yeah, it's, uh, I mean, that's just the way it goes. And every once in a while you'll run into a cattywampus field. That's what I call it, cattywampus. So, but it's all right. It still grows the crop. <laughs> it does a good job, too. So, all right. Well, we're going to let these guys get to the end of this field. And we're going to get started in our next field. And we will be done with harvesting on the whole map. So, I'll see you when we get over in the other field. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. This has been a long time coming. But, uh, yes, we are about halfway through our last field. And uh, we are going to end up with a little over 4 million liters. Uh, no, yeah, that's right. A little over four million liters of mustard, and that's off of 2,800 acres. Uh, like I said, if this 28 acres had been planted in wheat or barley, uh, it would have probably been close to twice that much. But, uh, it doesn't sell for near as much either. So, uh, we're going to see how we turn out, how we come out on this. And, uh, you know, that's going to govern whether we uh, continue planting mustard or whether something else will be a little more profitable. So, 
Uh, we'll just have to see. Uh, leave me a comment on what you think this is going to bring money-wise. Now I'm going to hold off until the price is up there pretty well uh, at the top. You know, as much as they'll pay. But, yeah, leave me a message. Leave me a comment. See what, see what you think. But, uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and uh, get this field done. And you know, we're going to be done with harvest season. All right. Well, <clears throat> harvest season is over. We have harvested and completed the last field. <clears throat> and it has been, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm sorry. <clears throat> it's been a, <laughs> uh, a long, long harvest, I guess, is what you would say. But we are uh, emptying these harvesters out. We've got to go back that way anyway, so we're going to, instead of putting this into the truck, uh, we'll just take it over and empty it into the silo. Because we got to go that way anyway, so we might as well. Oh, it's beautiful. All that land already harvested with a lot of work. A lot of work. All right. Well, we're going to shut these harvesters down and we'll take this over to the uh, silo empty it and I think we're going to call it a day <laughs> uh, yes uh, if you like this video uh, go down there and give me a like if you would please uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and please share uh, that helps that helps the channel Leave me a comment. You know I like to talk about commercial farming. So, but anyway, uh, the dirt road farmer, I'm going to call it a day. And as always, thank you for watching. <laughs>